Hi right, guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have Astria. I actually played this yesterday for like five hours. I got to like level 12 and there was a part in it. I'm not sure if it's beatable. Um, so what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to try to speed run to that point so I don't have to edit the video. Um, and I'm hoping one of three things happens. I look at it for a short amount of time, figure out the puzzle. Um, somebody else uses this video, gets to the part I get stuck at and somehow figures it out. Okay guys, update. I actually did beat the game, so that's super exciting. I'm gonna edit it in. Um, I'm just adding this in to let you know I did beat it, but as always, I'll leave a link to the game, and if you like the video, please like and subscribe. Hopefully this video will help you. I'll leave timestamps to every level, and I'm gonna edit out like the parts where I like, got like stuck or like things that took me forever, so you can just see how to beat it if you need help. And the creator, again, did an amazing job on this game. Like, some of the puzzles, I can't even fathom how he came up with them. And he did this in a year by himself. And it's like, game studios don't make games that he's good. This is really freaking amazing. But thanks for watching, as always, guys. And uh, back to past me, I guess. This game was made by a single developer, and it's freaking amazing. Like, it's really well made. It was inspired by Portal. And it really does have, like, some out-of-the-box thinking to solve some of the puzzles. Um... But, yeah, and it's not in English. I don't know what the language is. It's possibly French, but I'm going to try to read it for you guys. And, yeah. I, oh, God. I actually deleted my video yesterday. I got so frustrated, but... Oh, I also found out what the thousand sub goals going to be. I'm going to play through... Uh, oh, our, pl our planet is solely fading into darkness. The sky has turned dark for many years now. Nothing grows anymore. It's not like there's no energy left. An old story mentions that Astrid draws his energy from a hidden source that would finally turn off someday. Does this legend have something to do with my ring? I need to find the source. It's our last hope. But yeah, uh, I'm going to try to run through this pretty quickly since I know how to actually do a lot of the puzzles. I don't know what... I don't know what phase, what do you do on level 12, but yeah, I can get all the way to it. I think level 12 might be the last level, but I'm not positive because I can't beat it. Um, but yeah, oh crap. Speedrun failed. Reset button. No, I'm not actually like speedrun in spirit, not speedrun in actual speed. Eed. Nah, that wall keeps cucking me. Jeez. But yeah, um, for our thousand subs uh, goal thing, if we make it that, when we make it there, uh, I'm gonna play through that. There is no game like the new one where it's like actually a full game, and I'm gonna try to get all the achievements. No promises on all the achievements. I will beat it, but I can't promise I'll get all the achievements. Oh, gotta go over here. Do, do, do. But yeah, I love this game. It was really well made, especially for one person. I should probably be reading that. Basically, you finally understood, Gwen. Who's there? You're clueless about your presence here, right? You, your people are so ignorant. Are so ignorant. I am Ajani. I have been living beside you forever. I just didn't have the energy to communicate with you. When you picked up the power sphere, you awoke my spirit. You're the ring? Je suis encore trop faible I'm still too weak to explain what you should know. Utilise les capacités que Use ma my abilities to explore the cave. Dans cette caverne. Oh. But yeah, basically all the sphere said was you can use the M key to use the map, which I don't think is super useful. And you, now I can pick up things with the E key. You unlock power-ups as you play through the game. I'll read the rest of them. That one I was just kind of not thinking. Oop. Oop. Oh, you get in there. <laughs> but yeah, the um, those little sphere things are pretty neat because you can, uh, you'll see, it gets really wild what you have to do with the spheres to like progress in the game. I was, <laughs> one of the things is though, I did find a glitch in the, le um, the 11th floor and I'll tell you what it is when I get to it. I'm not going to do it myself because it literally, if that glitch happens, you have to replay through the whole level. And I had to play through level 11 like three times. That might be why I was too discouraged to beat level 12 if it's beatable. I just don't know if it is. Or I don't think it is. But I could be wrong. I have been wrong many, many times before. 
boop. Yay. Permanent platform activated. Boop, boop, boop. Hey, we made it back. Let's go. Okay, we opened the door somewhere. Somewhere. Do, 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 do. Oh, crap. Does it not come all the way? Oh, yeah. Never mind. I need a block. I need a block. Gimme, gimme. But yeah, the music's super relaxing. The cave looks really nice. Beautiful game. Really wish I could beat it, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I'm just getting set in reasonable expectations. This is more of a point through to show you how to get where I got to, and hopefully someone can take it from there. Oh yeah, I remember this. Okay. I was like, what do we, what is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh crap, my bad. Come back. Oh yeah, I need the block actually for that part, but I can set this up. So. And one more boop here. Boop. Oh god, wrong one. Okay, wait a second. I just gotta get it on the swing back. No, too far. Okay. Doo -doo. I'll show you. I'll pretty much talk about all the places where I got stuck when I first played through as well. Hopefully that's helpful to somebody. Um, this was not it. I think it was actually the next level where I started getting like kind of stuck. Oh, I thought it wasn't moving. I was like, did the cube slip? No. But yeah, the ring is really cool because when you get like certain power ups, it starts changing colors and it really the game's beautiful. And like I said, I only found like one really big glitch on level 11 um, when I was playing through this yesterday. And for a solo developer with like a puzzle game with so many ways you can interact with things, that's pretty freaking amazing. Normally, if this was like a solo developer by like this level right here, the game would be over. Like there would be some kind of glitch. This is where I first got stuck. Okay. So... One thing I didn't think about that's really out of box way to use mechanics is it's not even that hard, but I just never thought about it to be honest with you. It took me forever. Um, there's a cube in here, and you need to put it on the platform and raise the platform up. And for some reason, that was not clicking with me. Like, I was like, I use the platforms, not the cubes. You don't put cubes on platforms, but that's actually a thing you have to do um, after you do this part right here. Like, that was brain-boggling me forever. And I didn't know that platform was in there. It's kind of important in this game to get, like, an overall, like, grasp of the level and where things are before you start solving it because you might have to do it out of order. You picked up an artifact upgrade. Press right-click while aiming at hook points to discover new locations inside the floor. You gave me a bit of energy. Look at those spheres hung on the wall. They are hook points. Yes, they are. Sick. That's all he's got to say to me. Okay, so this is what I'm talking about with the platform thing that took me forever. This is part of the reason it took me forever, though, is the fact I didn't know about that door and the fact I got a new power up in here. But after struggling for like 30 minutes, I figured it out. Not no big deal. Just 30 minutes. 30 minutes is a super long time, I think, to spend on a level. This simple, like a simple level. But it's still, it's pretty neat. Do do do. Can I reach that? Not from here. Okay. So we go up here. Also, what's kind of cool is is these things. I've seen this mechanic before, but depending on how high you're falling from is how high they bounce you. That's something that's pretty neat. And like the creator said, there are multiple ways to do some of these puzzles. Like one of these puzzles that I, the way I do it is not. God dang it! I didn't raise the platform high enough. Well. The way I do it on one of these levels is not the correct way to do it, but I don't feel like it's the correct way anyways. It could be. I don't think it is, though. Because I basically die with the cube and it teleports it across the lake because of the way the level respawns. 
And I was like, well, thank God. Because <laughs> I didn't know how to actually do it the right way. But <laughs> hopefully that'll work on this playthrough. I'm sure it will. The game's actually pretty consistent with what happens when you die or like when you do something. So that's really good game design. I hate when like there's RNG to something that happens. That's usually really bad. Okay, where's the jumper at that I'm trying to get to? Oh yeah, I know, I know. Like across, yeah. Something, something. Miss the jump. Put it, oh, I was about to say, if I hit this jumper though. Oh, well, damn. Well, hey. Okay, screw this. Oh, I missed again. Also, the hook points. Even though I usually hate this mechanic in any games, because usually it's like super frustrating. It's really well done in this game, and it's not. It's not like it's um. It's not. He does never puts it in the game to be like the challenging point of the level, like having to do the hook shots and trying to do them consistently. So that's really nice. But yeah, we already shaved like thirty minutes off my other playthrough. Sick. That's one reason why I was like, I'll play through it one more time, see if I can help somebody. Just because um, if I play through it again, I don't have to edit the video. And with my internet, some of you guys may know this, um, who watch the channel, it, uh, my internet is awful. So it takes like years for me to upload videos, especially long ones. If it's like three hours long, it's gonna take me a hot minute. So, the fact that I can replay through this, do it pretty quickly with while knowing where the puzzles are, is gonna make this a lot. And I couldn't find like a game I wanted to play, like outside of this one. There's like no HIO game I wanted to play at all. I think there's something I'm supposed to hit here. Go back over there. Please. And thank you. Where's the button for the... There's a button for the door, right? Somewhere. I don't remember. I know there is one, though. Hmm. Oh, it's down. Oh, okay. But, uh, I feel like I'm missing something right now. Where was it? There's something to make this hook point go up. I don't know where it's at. Because mm -hmm. where it's at right now, I can't get the hops. Where's the button at? Is it up here? Is this it? No, that's the orange platform button. Hmm. Damn. Hmm. Wait a second. Can I? Wait a second, I think I'm doing this really dumbly. I do believe that's how I did it the first time though. I figured there was a point that I used the hook point to get up there. But I don't... Yeah, I need the hook point. What am I doing? Where is it? Lord almighty. Cut out time in some ways and then you add it back in others. I know there's a button somewhere that I'm missing that makes that hook point move and I have no idea where it's at. We'll fall back in the hole. Maybe I missed it down there. Hmm, not seeing it. Hmm. Huh. What the heck? Oh! Oh, yeah, okay. I was trying to get ahead of myself, which was making this. Let's go. I'm dumb. <laughs> Surprise! There. Yeah, I was like one step ahead of myself, and it was really throwing me off because I did it that way the first time because I didn't think about the platform. There we go. Now we're cooking. So 
bad for anyone that was actually actually expecting a speed run. This is like speed run ish. <laughs> speed run as fast as I can do it. Because I don't have the skills of a speedrunner, but I actually know what I'm supposed to be doing in this game, so. That's half the battle in a puzzle game, I think. Alright, let's. Oh! Well, it's coming, anyways. Don't miss! Hey! <laughs> I think I missed it the first time and I had to come down anyways, but that time I made it. Hooray. Yay. And this will move the hook point, which means I can jump across the water. I remember being like super relieved that this level wasn't that hard after the last level I was stuck on it for so long. Yeah, I did. A I think I actually might have done better on this level the first time I played through, <laughs> to be honest with you. Boom. Probably need to bring the cube up here, right? Or do I? Coming back down? Oh, yeah, I remember what I'm supposed to do here. This one kind of got me. It didn't super get me, but I was actually like, this was one of the big, first big brain things of the game where I was like, oh, that's really freaking neat. But I missed, I think, a couple times too. Hopefully I won't miss. Boom. Yay. Yeah, I, I was surprised I didn't get stuck here, actually, but... Uh, now I gotta, like, go this way, right? Now, where am I supposed to be going? Somewhere. Oh, there we go. Haha! <laughs> it was behind me the whole time. I think we're about almost halfway to my demise for my puzzle skills. Oh, stretch. But yeah, I was feeling like super cocky because there's like this pipe thing in this game where you have to set up the pipes and like connect them. I was like, I'm pretty good at these puzzles actually, but it gets like super hard. Like he adds in like diagonal pipes and like, you'll see, it's crazy. It's insane in the membrane. This one's weird. I do this. Yeah, I like lucked into finding that button last time. What was I supposed to do? Oh, there it is. Yeah. What was I supposed to do after I do that? Something. Oh. Oh, I was supposed to put the cube on here. That's what I was supposed to do. Take me back. Oh wait, do I grab the cube from this side actually? I think I do actually. I think it's like, Never mind. Uh, whatever. We'll be back. I know I find the cube somewhere. I think I actually have to travel up this thing and get a cube. Boom, baby. Yeah. Okay, now I ride the platform. With the cube? Or should I open the door first? Let's open the door first and get another cube, I believe. Maybe. Take me. I know there's a door over here. I don't know if I'm supposed to open the door yet, though. But I guess we'll see. The king has returned. Okay. Now this lowers that platform, right? Yeah. Now I need a... I'm missing a cube, right? Oh, no. Okay, got it. Tracking. Boom. Take me across. See if I can grab it in time. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. That's a speed run move right there. <laughs> Big brain place. Oh, well, I went the wrong way. Reset button. One thing I do hate about replaying through the game, so you don't get like the initial reaction of like what I was thinking or how I had to think to solve things. But I mean, it does save a lot of time and I'm sure people don't like to watch people wander around for like hours. I think I got to level 11 in two hours and 40 minutes without any edits. 
and the game's supposed to be about three hours long, but level 11's where I first really got stuck. Like, I got stuck for like 40 minutes to like an hour or something like that because one, that two, the level ending glitch that I got hit with twice and because that level was actually super hard for me. Oh my God, it was hard for me. Whew. I'm telling you, that level is not nice. Once you get it, it's not too bad, but I had, it took me forever to figure it out. And it took me forever to figure out that it was glitched. All right, floor six. What was that? Uh, this is where the can was, right? I need to, yeah. Boom. I don't remember what I'm supposed to do here. Something. Uh, oh, platform. Gotcha. No, I don't. I don't got you. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. What am I doing here? Oh, yeah. This works. Yeah, that's where it's good to know that um, <laughs> hitting a jumper at like the same height does that. Nice. Oh, I'm supposed to put the cube on it. Yeah, that's what I'm supposed to do. Now I'm tracking. I like completely forgot how you're supposed to play this level. Oh, this level took me a while to figure out as well. Oh my god, dude. Like, it took me for- because there's certain things in the game where the creator just does not explain it. And you have to kind of figure out how it works. Which is pretty rough on this level, particularly. This level and level 11. Uh, did I already put it on there? Yeah, sick. Oh boy. But yeah, some of these puzzles, like, actually solving them, I'm just like... How did this one think up, <laughs> like, working puzzles like this? I guess you have to have, like, a certain kind of brain for it. I, a certain kind of brain I don't have. Because, like, I can sometimes, most of the time, solve a puzzle. But I can't even think, like, what kind of thinking you would have to do to put together your own puzzles. Hate me. I activated... Okay, I was about to say, let's go. Yay. You picked up an artifact upgrade. You can now use the left click to throw energy spheres. Hooray. I'll soon be able to explain your presence here. Keep exploring the cave. Okay. So, you have to shoot these, and how many times you shoot it is how much it shoots the ball. And you have to, like, point them in certain directions to get them to shoot in certain things. But, watch this. This took me forever to figure out. Like, you have to pick up the ball sometimes. Like, you have to get it to shoot it at you and grab it. I missed it. Oh, grab it. Okay. But, yeah. Like, I have to body block it here and then not do that. Okay, dude. Oops. This... It doesn't look... Grab it! When <laughs> somebody knows what they're doing, that doesn't look too hard, but Jesus, boy. And then this part is actually kind of hard, getting in this stupid hole. I don't know if this is even... I, it has to be the wrong... This is the only way I can think of doing this puzzle. But I can't get it in there, please. Maybe I picked it up at the wrong angle or something. I know you can get it in there. It's just fighting me right now. Eventually you get a power up where you can toss these things, which is awesome. But I don't have it. Mm. Please, yes! There you go. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, bro. Oh, so... Uh, it's only 20 minutes. I'm like halfway through where I got to already. So, amazing. Whew. Yeah. I don't remember. That's where the teleporter is, right? I don't want to do that yet. I don't think. What am I supposed to be doing here? I know I need to take the. I need the block. That's what I need. Okay, got you. Got you. Alright, 
I gotta do something here to get the block over there. Click point at. Oh. I don't remember how to do this. I'll figure it out. Screw it. What are you holding activated right now? The door? Okay. Alrighty. Let's see. Let's try to remember where the cube is. There's a cube up. That's what that hook points for. I forgot. Okay, got it. Having a hard time remembering what it was. Like, I know how to beat these puzzles. This shouldn't take too long. Forgot how to do the puzzles. <laughs> Where's the block at? Over there. Okay. Thick. Yeah, you gotta put the hook point in the right spot, or you can just get lucky like that. Sick. You know what I think I actually did when I first played through this? As I took the cube off the door thing, and then I grabbed the other cube, put it to open the door, and took the other cube for some reason. I don't know why. It's because I was like trying to work it out as I was going through the level, that's why. But it was really stupid. It was just really stupid. Because I basically took one cube to do the, the job another cube was already doing. It was really bad. I was like, Jesus Christ. It's Jason Bourne. This is the puzzle, the pipe puzzles. At first I was like, I am awesome at these. And then as the game progressed, I, am, I was like, I am not awesome at these actually. Later on you get where you can rotate the pieces and whatnot. What you think would make it, I don't know, anytime you get a new power in games like this, the game just gets harder. You think you, you're like powering up shows should be easier, but that's never the case ever, actually. So. Never the case. Always gets harder. I also noticed that lock in the bottom right, that is basically, oh, your people only know a few things about the planet you live on. Astria has not always been inhabited by Astrians. All others were here before you. They were very powerful and peaceful civilization. When you people appeared, you lived among them for a while, but things did not turn out very well. They all died a long time ago. Jeez, I had to burp or like, clear my throat so bad there. Sorry. But yeah, if you want a challenge, I know I'm already saying this when I'm halfway through the game, play through the rest of the game. You are going to face defensive weapons. Avoid their beams at all costs. Why is this place so well protected? Why is this place hiding? The cave is hiding the heart of Astria. Life on the planet relies on him, and defensive weapons are here as protection. Clock is ticking, Gwen. Keep going deeper inside the cave. I will tell you everything as you move forward. Okay, thanks, Pam. But yeah, this game... If you want a good challenging puzzle, try to play it without watching this video, because it is a lot harder than it looks. God dang boy, it is. I'm not saying like, oh, I'm not great at puzzle games. Like I cannot play The Witness at all. The Witness pisses me off because it doesn't tell you how to do the puzzles at all. It just wants you to figure it out from like other puzzles you did. Oh, it's frustrating as a, oh, it pisses me off actually. The witness pisses me off really bad. Not a fan. Well, first off, let's do this. I know this has to be done. Okay, what else am I supposed to do here? Oh, yeah. Now I shoot this. Did I turn the laser beam off again? Oh, it went off by itself. Nice. You pre oh, fudge. Well, at least I remember before it was too late. Where's the platform thing at? Is this a platform? Yeah, okay. Ah, uh, shoot. Do I have to stand on it while I'm shooting it? Oh, nice. Sick. Got it. Actually, I think I need to shoot. Let me shoot one more in there before I um, do whatever I was going to do there. Okay, come here, bud. Son of a... What? Okay, well, that wasn't supposed to happen. Well, darn it. Oh, I know what happened. I'm an idiot. 
No reason to be alarmed. Me being an idiot. <laughs> but yeah, eventually when you get your power to throw like objects, um, nice. What was I gonna say? When you get your power to throw objects, you can throw the balls without breaking them, which is awesome. But they, the game doesn't tell you that really. It tells you that you can throw things and they're likely to explode, but I don't think it tells you you can throw things and them not explode, which is important. But yeah, you need a ball to do that. So I'm gonna put this on that for some reason. No, wait. Wait. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, great. Uh, hmm. What am I supposed to do here? I don't remember. I think there's like a way to move that hook point, but I don't remember how to do it. Oh, yeah, I do. Okay, gotcha. I think I'm gonna have to move the cannon probably. Ah, oh, nice. Sick. We did it. Boom. Progress. Now I need to get this low as possible. There we go. Sick. Put this up here. Send it back up. Yeah, as you could tell, I took a had a pretty decent sleep after giving up on this game. Oh crap! I put the did I put it too high? Hmm. Is there not another hook that I can reach? Actually. There we go. I was about to say, I'm pretty sure I have to have the cube all the way up here so I can... If I remember correctly. And I do. Hooray. Yeah, but that little lock in the bottom right turns green when you actually solve this puzzle right here. Which gets more and more complicated. The diagonal pieces are pretty hard to figure out. When you have to rotate, it gets really hard to figure out. Hmm. Uh, I don't remember what I'm doing here. I do know, however, you have to do both these puzzles at the same time. I know that for a fact. You gotta do both the yellow things at the same time. So. Oh, I don't have rotate yet, which makes the puzzles actually a lot more easier. The fact I don't have rotate because I have to know where certain pieces are going to go for sure. This isn't right, my brain. <laughs> goes here for sure. This probably goes here somehow. Maybe. gotta be I'm struggling way more on this than I did the last time for sure goodness gracious what is this the only piece going to the left is this one so it has to connect there hmm what the heck There we go. Yeah, I struggle way more on that. Usually I don't struggle on those until like way later in the game, but not this time. Wait, yeah, we're only 34 minutes in. The ancient civilization of Asteria, Astria, arrived a long time after Astria was created, as it was not possible to live in Astria in good conditions. They had to make these conditions by creating a heart which would enable them to live on, in this planet. This is how your people came to life. Okay. 
fluorite. Let's see. Oh yeah, this level's annoying. This level is really annoying, actually. Because this level, you kind of have to bounce back and forth multiple times, which takes time and it's kind of annoying. Least favorite level, by far. No, it's not. Yeah. If it was more hard, it would be my least favorite level. Level 12 is my least favorite level. I can't beat it. I might come back and do that one. Do to do. <gasps> All right. Now I have to. Yeah. Okay. Got it. <gasps> and now, this part confused me for a good bit too. Any part where you have to actually catch the cannonball is really confusing to me almost every time. Or got me on my first playthrough pretty good. Please. I got it. Mm hmm. Once you figure it out though, like certain things like this, you get used to using later on in the game, but nothing tells you that you have to ever pick those up, so, or that you can even grab them in the first place. There's like nothing really letting you know that you can do that, so. Hmm. Oh yeah, I need to put the, yeah, this is where I have to backtrack a lot. Cause you got to put on the defensive weapon, then you have to rate, lower the weapon. And then you have to do something else, like, uh, and I think you could possibly run through two of these at a time, but I died a bunch trying to do it the last time, because I was like getting frustrated from running back and forth. Yay. All right. Help order. Yeah, the reason why you have to run back is because you have to get the key. I don't even know if I need to run back, actually. What I can do is... That's probably just me being new to, or like not knowing the level yet, so I thought I had to run back, but you, I think you can hook shot across. Yeah, that's sick. Uh-oh. What am I supposed to do here? Ooh, not that. <laughs> Timed. something wrong here yet again it's your boy doing something wrong
darn it, dude. Well, darn it. Struggling <sighs> way more than I should be. something but it's not well oh duh I'm an idiot okay no wait I actually um uh... hmm give me a second I wonder I don't remember if I have to have these both activated at the same time or not, to be honest with you. I know that's getting annoying. Jeez. I think I... Not sure. Not sure. I know that moves the hook point, right? I'm pretty sure. Hmm. Oh, I'm struggling. Boom. Yeah, I was dumb. <laughs> but... Yes, we did it. Hooray. God darn, dude. Whew. That was killing me for some reason. Like, really bad. Whew. We did it. Hooray. What am I supposed to do here? Something. I think there's a power up over here. Yeah. You picked an artifact upgrade. You can now split the energies of the ring using the mouse wheel. You choose between red and blue energy. Throw, red cube in throw the red energy into asteroid cube or sphere to destroy it. You can also inject a massive quantity of energy into a cube or sphere. Grab the cube or sphere and press the left click and send it away. This ability has a great chance to destroy the cube, but not the sphere. It doesn't say that it doesn't destroy the sphere, but it doesn't say that it does either. Oh. Oh. oh wait, this is kind of cool. Watch this. This is sick. Boom. Yeah. Ride the cube. Uh, do I need to touch the button? I don't... No, I don't. That's only if you messed up. I didn't mess up. Yeah, I don't think you're supposed to actually solve When the ancients settled in Astria, they were really not alone. Not really alone. A dark force was here and was responsible for the chaos of the planet. Cataclysm swallowed the energy from Astria until everything died. By building the heart, the ancient found a way to seal him and restore the energy of a, the planet for a few time. For some time. At level 9. Um... Yeah, on that last one, you didn't actually have to do both of them at the same time. But, I, I guess we got lucky after looking at it for like an hour. Do do do. This one hard. I don't even remember this one, to be honest. Oh, it's not hard. It's just another one with backtracking and stuff. A lot of backtracking. Confusing. This one's confusing. Not hard. Where's the cube? Yeah, so you blow up the cube with the red energy so you can get across pretty much and you have to go to the left side first I believe and then there's another one where you have to catch the ball of doom 
after you move the hook point somehow. Where do I get the ball from? Oh yeah. Send it. Well, this should be a little bit easier. I don't think I knew I could throw the ball at this point. I think I actually did something. Did I do something else to do that? I don't remember. I don't remember how I got the ball up here the first time, actually. Oh, son of a... Actually, I need another ball. Hmm. What if I get another? Oh, wait. Is there? Uh, maybe I need that cube. Oh no, the ball's already in there. What am I supposed to be? Oh, getting rid of the ball. Yeah. Look at that timing, boy. make it <laughs> oh uh oh huh. ah ah mm. stuck stuck psych <gasps> now I have this cube that's what the cube's for. There you go. I gotta get this cube. Come here, bud. Yay, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're really doing it. Um. Yeah. How did I do this last time? I know it was something really stupid. I did something really stupid last time, I think. Or I just... Wait a second. Give me a second. Watch this. It's gonna be cool. Come here, ball. Yay! Boom! Boom! Oh. Boom! Please. Grappling hook. Now. Now I do this. Uh. But yeah, this is like a huge brain puzzle. Like, how many moving pieces you have to do to get this where you can move it where you need it to go is pretty insane. I think. Me thinks. Okay, let's start solving this bad boy. Oh yeah, this is where I can start rotating the pieces, so watch this. This is where it starts getting really confusing with the pipes. I don't think I had to rotate the pieces to do this last time, though, to be honest with you. I think I just kind of did it. I don't think it forces you to rotate yet. No, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Boom. Alright. Now. Ah, was I supposed to do that? Ah. Oh, thank God. <laughs> what a shot. Boom. Okay. Now what you got to do is, is when you move this here, it changes where the green light comes from. When you get it where... Give me a second. Technical difficulties. So once I light that up, that's a relay point now. So... Now, gotta get it where, get some of that energy, this sucker, I don't really know how to do, but, you know, hmm, I really don't remember, oh, yeah, gotcha, kind of, maybe, maybe not, there we go, that's the way we do it. Money for nothing. Maybe you did have to rotate things here, actually. Huh. Boom. Done. Let's get out of here. 
How do I get on that platform again? Jumper. Wee. Right? And odd, and then I do this. Hooray! Done. Yeah, that was a long one for me, too. I haven't even hit it yet. How are yet? Oh gosh, we're going so fast. The heart built by an ancient civilization gives the required energy necessary to maintain life on the planet. The balance of the world lies on him. Unfortunately, the heart cannot stay active forever, and the ancients used the cataclysm's energy to maintain its power. They are no longer do here to do that. This is why your people are dying. Your people are dying. It's for these reasons that your people are dying. Okay. Floor 10. This floor's hard. This floor. This is the one where I think I glitched it, but it worked, so I was more than happy that it worked. Good enough for me to do it. <laughs> because you're supposed to, I think. Yeah, I'll show you. Eventually, when I get there. Open the door. This is one of those ones that's hard because honestly, I didn't think about doing this part first. Made it very difficult. Level 11 takes the whole thing on a whole nother level of difficult. My gosh. My goodness gracious. Hmm. Doing something wrong here. For sure. <laughs> For sure doing something wrong here. Uh, but what? I activated a platform, right? Let's see. So that platform is in here. And... Oh. Where's the platform at? Come back down. <laughs> ah, we made it. Sick. Okay. This is where it gets kind of sketchy on if I'm doing this like the correct way you're supposed to do it or not. So there seems to be like a really convoluted way to get the purple sphere through here, but this is what I do. Let me see if I remember how to do this right. No, that ain't it. But close, watch. So, what I did last time was I got it where it pretty much recognized that I was here, the game. And once you get it to recognize that, what you can do is, is you can grab this cube really quick, die, and it'll respawn you over there with the cube. Right? No, it didn't work. Did it work? It really worked. Okay. Yeah, I don't think that's the right way to do it, but. Oh, I did it. When you do that. And then it does something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the messed up way to do it. I don't know the right way to do it. But you basically just get it to recognize that you're spawning over there. And then you spawn over there. <laughs> like, that's pretty much it. Oh, Lord. Then, I think I can actually... I think I can actually beat it from here. Watch this. I don't know if this is the right way to do it again but it's a way to do it so good enough alright uh, uh, I know I need to get it over there 
I don't remember how to do it. Something, something. Mumble, mumble, grumble, mad. This works. This works. Boom. Okay. Now we've moved it. I know you're supposed to do a thing over there too if you do it the right way, but yeah. I don't think I need to if you do it the wrong way. Honestly. Um. Yeah, I don't need this over here anymore. And I get this piece now, so that's really nice, actually. So, there you go. Boom. Uh, now I just gotta get that last piece in there. How do we do such a thing? Oh, yeah, that works. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. don't work. What? Who thought that was going to work? <sighs> Fire that man. I think I actually have to move that to there somehow and do something dumb. Like something like this. And then something like this maybe? No, that ain't it. That ain't it. Close. Not it. Um, hmm. Why am I struggling at this so badly? This should not be the hard part of this, honestly. But it is. Oh, yeah, I'm an idiot. Okay, yeah, I'm dumb. Give me a second. Jeez. Huh. There you go. Woo. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is, even though it may not be the correct way to do it, again, I don't think I need y'all over here anymore, actually. Sick. Uh, something that I might be missing, which might make me have to backtrack because I'm dumb, is... I think I turned off the laser beams over there. God dang it. Lol. <laughs> oh well. Hate to see that happen. <sighs> Damn. Is there another way to do this? Yes, there is. Ah, oh, so aggravating. I'm up. Give me a second. We'll see if I can do this with the. Uh, green thing over here. I don't know if you can, because I didn't last time, but you never know. Looks like I can. Yeah, I think I can. Ooh, that saves me some time. I really didn't want to have to move the green thing back to the start. That would be tragic. Boom. Okay. Wait, is that the right platform? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh, I can't reach that far. That's sick. Would be nice. But... God, I'm so confused. Confused myself. <sighs> I 
thought that was the one that moved the platform. That one right there, not the... Mm. I'm sorry, I can read it right now, actually. This will work though, watch this. I'm about to figure it out. Yeah, that's the main thing, just moving the conduit. You can do everything from there. I didn't think you could, but I guess you can. All right, problem solved. Lord almighty, yeah. Trying to do that out of the order, I think confused me more than doing it the right way. Honestly, the first time I did it, I didn't move the relay point. I just did this point first, which I think was probably actually more correct. I gotta go like that, that, that. Oh, I missed. But yeah, you gotta do something where you like hook yourself up and then hook yourself to the other one right here, like this. Then you gotta somehow move this here. You shoot this and then that disarms the weapons, right? Hopefully. All right, nice. Yeah, I was questioning what I was trying to do there is see if I actually needed to do that part. I was seeing if I could skip it, but that part you actually have to do. That was dumb on my part. Actually, a lot of parts going on there, but that was just me being dumb. Okay, now I just gotta go back to what I was doing earlier. Which, luckily messing around with it made me remember that this is not as hard as I was making it, so that's good. It's actually super easy. The fact I'm struggling on this so hard though makes me think that level 12 is possible, because this pipe puzzle, the one on level 12 was the part that I was stuck on, but I don't know if it is possible though, because I was using all the pieces, and it just didn't feel like I had enough pieces to get it done. Oh, I needed to... Boom. Yay. Okay. Picked up an artifact upgrade. You can now build hook points and holders. Use Q to switch from build mode to energy mode. Select the element with the mouse wheel and build it with the left click. You can build a maximum of three different elements on authorized location. <laughs> this power sphere, sphere was the penultimate. The artifact will be at its full power soon. Sick. Okay. Now I just need to go to the... Oh, wait. Ah. Oh, wait. I don't think I was supposed to take the teleporter there. Maybe I was. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I think I'm supposed to build something. There we go. Boom. There we go. Teleporter's only if you didn't do the final platform thing already. This level was hard. The cave. The heart of Astria has not always been hidden into this cave, and its existence was not a secret. When your people came to comes to life, they quickly understood how powerful it was. You wanted this energy for yourself for your nefarious purposes, but the ancient decided to hide the heart in this cave. Protect him. You raised, you raised against them all, and you killed them all. All right. Yeah, I got a little bit more stuck on that level down one too, but we got it. Alright. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll try to remember where to tell you where the glitch is. On this level. God dang it. And it's very avoidable if you do it the right way, but if you do it the wrong way, you are so screwed, actually. Did I not shoot it? Did I miss? Guess I missed. Ah. <laughs> ah. Oh my gosh, dude. Come on now. Yeah, screw it. I hit it? Okay. No confirmation on it. 
But this is the right way to do it. The last time I did this, I did it the wrong way and it took me forever. But you can do it that way. So what I did was, as I hook shot it to that platform, and then I hook shot. Oh, it was really dumb. Like I hook shot it from the plat here to the platform to over there. The better way to do it is just doing this, because you have to hit like a really weird angle to jump from that point to that other point. Okay, so the glitch deals with this cube right here. So later on in this game, you'll see that there's a teleporter. And if you take the teleporter and you die, that cube will despawn, like completely, and you will not be able to beat the level. It's really freaking frustrating. Uh, what do I need to do here? There. But yeah, I'll show you the teleporter and where it takes you back to. Actually, I probably won't even take the teleporter because I don't want to risk it glitching. Because you can do it without touching the teleporter. And that's where I actually goofed at, because I took the teleporter. The teleporter is only really to bring you back with the cube, I believe. If you, I think you could do it both ways, but if you, I know if you die, the cube despawns. If you take the teleporter, and you're screwed. Oh, that's so frustrating. And you need that, you have to have that cube to beat the game, or beat this level. From what I think, anyways, from my experience. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay, I need to move that great thing back a little bit and actually. Also a good thing to remember is this move that that thing that's stuck on right now. Um, once you get on that green platform, it's good to move it away, because it'll pick it up when the green platform starts moving. Oh, it's better to move it over there somewhere. Actually, I need to move it further because that green platform is going to go over there anyways. Okay. Now, you bring it back. But yeah. I cannot explain my frustration when I found out that this cube disappeared on me. It was literally tragic. I would honestly do it just to show the creator how it happens, but hopefully my explanation will be helpful enough for... The fact that people will be able to avoid that happening to them by watching this video is good enough for me, actually. Like, uh. Cause it, oh man, it pissed me off so bad. It was tragic. But that's really the only glitch I found in the game. Oops. What am I supposed to be doing here? I don't remember. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This part took me forever to figure out because it doesn't tell you that watch that moves the platforms like it doesn't tell you that it just you have to figure it out for yourself and that took me forever and then some of the other things I've already done in this level took me forever and just tragic how hard this level is but we're almost to the part where I'm like stuck and I don't know what to do so um, another one is it supposed to be one, two, or three? Two. That's about two. Oh, three. This isn't going in for some reason. Go in. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Scream at it. Why aren't you going in? Oh. Yeah. All right. Now we do this. But you see how intricate like these des this design of the puzzles are? Like to make this bounce into everything, it's insane. Like this game is actually insane. So, something that's kind of cool is if you can grab that cube, if you die, it doesn't matter. The cube will spawn on the other side with you. That's nice. You just gotta grab the cube first. Please! Oh, I dropped it. Oh boy, that was really bad. Well, that's the first time I've actually dropped the cube. I was spamming the E key too much. 
Oh. What if it doesn't respawn? Oh. Oh, man. Can't tell the non respawning cube like scarred me for life. God. Coming at it at the wrong angle. Okay, there you go. That's how you do it. Probably a better way to do it, but that's the way I know how to do it. This part confused me forever, too. Because. Oh, watch this madness. I was wondering forever, like. What was the point of all this? Because all this does at the end of it is move the... You'll see. It's so dumb. It's not dumb. It's just like... How how are you supposed to know to do that? <laughs> like, for real. Uh, like, this part didn't confuse me here. Like, I knew I had to get the ball in there, but I didn't know why. You'll see, though. Really aggravating. I think it just needs to be flat right, actually. And just flat right. Now shoot it. Watch this. Oh, no, this is wrong. It needs to be down. Ah. Definitely been a day since I played this. Okay. So this platform goes over here, so I was like, why is it taking me over here? Watch this, this is why it's taking me over here. You're supposed to go down here and grab the ball. That's what you're supposed to be doing. So watch. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, well. Bend it again. <laughs> oh, that's crazy, bro. That puzzle is insane. Like, it's actually insane. <laughs> oh, gosh. Just so you can get this ball, bro. <sighs> that was- that whole puzzle was just to get this ball to you. No! Please don't go in the water! Oh, thank gosh, it respawned over here. That was nice. I never threw it into the water, so I didn't know where it went. Like, do I have to grab another one for real? <sighs> okay. So. This is going to activate a teleporter. My advice to you, you can take the teleporter and possibly do this. I would not take the teleporter. Because when I took the teleporter, and say you die on accident, when you go over here, the orange cube's gone. It happened to me twice. It's not worth it. That teleporter over there, but do not take that. I would not, I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life, but I would not take it. I was about to say, I'm not lost the cube anyways. And you have, I think you have to have that cube for this part right here. Because you can't hook shot with the cube in your hand, so that's like the only way to really get the cube up here. And then this level also has another hard part. This part up here is ridiculous. Because you have to, from what, the way I did it, I don't know if there's another way to do it. But you have to get these blue things active, right? And what I had to do was, once I got the blue things activated and I got the platform up here, I had to deactivate them while moving a piece. I had to like, like there's this platform that flies over here. And so I would have to shoot a piece to activate that while that piece was going away. So I was having to take a shot while that thing was trying to yank me back over. It was crazy. You'll see. Because I don't know if there's another way to do it. There might be. Because that seems like a really ridiculous way to do it. But if there is another way to do it, I don't know how. So, yay. Ah. 
don't remember how this goes either. So, considering how bad I've been struggling with these puzzles today, it might take me a little bit. Actually not. Look at that. I got that so fast. Look at this. Yeah, the hard one comes super easy to me for some reason. <laughs> so what I was having to do here is move this diagonal piece. Oh god, it was ridiculous, dude. Watch. You'll see. You'll see. You'll see. I need to stop talking about it and just do it. Also, it's taking me forever to figure out how to hook shot this in the right angle to get up here. But that's how you do it. You get underneath it directly. I was trying to do it like way off diagonally and it was really hard. Alright, so... From what I... the way I did it, I had to like... move that diagonal piece. So I had to like shoot it and then shoot it again. Hopefully I do it right on the first try. Because it starts yanking you right when you move it, so you have to do it pretty... quickly. Did I get it? Yeah! Yeah! Okay. Yeah. That's wild, right? Because how I was trying to figure it out was like trying to figure out where I had everything lit up at the same time. I don't think that's possible. Could be. I don't think so, though. From my experience. Okay, this is the level where I get stuck, so this might be the end of the video. I'm gonna spend some time looking at it. The ancient built a powerful technology to seal the cataclysm inside the heart. When your civilization attacked them, they knew no one would be able to do that in quite a short time before they all passed away. They built the ring, allowing the owner to go inside the cave and protect the Astria. I am an ancient that was sealed inside the artifact to help your world survive. You kill my people. We keep saving yours. Okay. So there's a pipe puzzle like the one I just did it like moments ago that for the life of me I can't figure out how to do it. I'll show you what I'm talking about, but I, this might be the end of the video. I'm not gonna spend like if I don't figure it out like pretty quickly. I'm just gonna give up on it because I spent like hours looking at it yesterday. I don't remember what that does. Oh yeah, I know what it does. Watch this. This is cool. Boom. I don't know if this is how you're supposed to do it either, but this is how I do it. Alright. Now that we're in here, this is where it gets ridiculous. For me anyways. So I'm pretty sure you're supposed to make it where you can bounce the ball to you, right? You can make this cannon shoot. Right? But you can... You have to get it where... This moves here... By using one, one of these triggers. This is one of the triggers. This is one of the triggers. And you have to move this up here. And this down here. So they can even hit each other, right? But there's not enough pieces from my experience to make that happen. Granted, I spent hours trying to do this yesterday, but I don't think there's anything else in the room that you can do either. Like, to make this, like, until you figure out that cannon part, I don't think there's, like, anything you can interact with in this world. Like, see, there's nothing I can reach here. There's nothing I can really, oh, maybe, wait a second, give me a second, maybe. But either way, you have to figure out that cannon part eventually, because that's an integral part of the level. Oh, maybe this will help. Yeah, I can make defensive beams. Use F to activate a defensive shield, which will protect you from beams with purple energy. Be careful, Gwen. That shield won't protect you from every defensive weapon. Well, let's see something real quick. Maybe, maybe this is beatable. Because I didn't get that last time. Because I was so stuck on this stupid freaking thing for years. I, I didn't think that there was something that you could put here to like blow it up. Like I was pretty sure of that. Because I this one right here is the one that does that. But I was like, 
I think I have to do the cannon thing first, but I guess I was wrong. Like I said, I've been wrong before. I'm pretty okay with being wrong, as long as it gets solved at the end of the day. Sure. Ah, uh, do I need a cube of some sort? No, I can make it. I can make it. No. No! Oh. Uh. <laughs> no. No, I'm stuck. Oh, fuck. Bro, I don't remember. Pray for me. Oh my god. Why would I do that to myself? Oh my god, I just Indiana Jones my fucking self. Oh my god. Okay, cool. I fucking hate. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so I need a cube of some sort there. Obviously. Not whatever I was doing, apparently. <laughs> That's so tragic, bro. Oh my god. At least if I need to figure out how the puzzle pieces go, which I think I have an idea now that I've done it once, I can look it up on my video. So, if I have to stop the video recording. It's only been an hour and a half. That's pretty amazing. This game's supposed to take three hours long. This is not the final level, though. Good luck, guys. Good luck. Oh, my God. All right, give me my purple power. Oh, wait, I went the wrong way. Fuck, oh, let's solve this first. I don't need it to solve this. How did we do this? This obviously goes here. And then something weird that I didn't think of apparently was this going here, this going here, 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 that, this, 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 boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Bruh, this broke my brain for so long. You have no idea. I gave up on this game because of this puzzle. Honestly. Honestly. And it's all that is. That's all it is. Ah, oh, screw me, dude. I'm gonna keep this ball, actually. I'm keeping the ball. The ball, I can get, I can always get more ball. To be honest with you. Oh, well. If I get the ball, I'm gonna keep the ball. You can always get more ball, boys. Give me that ball. Can I use the ball? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. I can throw the ball. Alright. So this is another thing that broke my brain just a second ago before I Indiana Jones myself. Because I'll probably cut to that part. Oh my god, dude. I can't believe I Indiana Jones myself. That was probably one of the dumbest things uh, I've done. Okay, you picked up an artifact upgrade. You can now use defensive beams using the building tool. Use F to activate a defensive shield, which will protect you from beams with purple energy. Be careful, Gwen. This shield will not protect you from every defensive weapon. Okay, something the creator should do here, unless he just wants the game to be hard, is explain that it doesn't just protect you, it reflects. It reflects. So watch. Oh, I'm gonna die. Ah, oh, it missed me. Suck it. Okay. Then you hit F so you can defend yourself and then you reflect it this is something the creator does not tell you he just wants you to figure it out i guess and it makes this level really hard so you gotta blow that up and the reason for blowing that up is to turn off the defensive weapons because it only blocks your own defensive weapons not regular defensive weapons oh i forgot my ball so you have to have something to put here I know there's probably a cube, that cube. I probably need that cube, to be honest with you. Why don't I just get that cube? Can I get that cube? How do I get over there? Can I get over there? Ah, screw it. I'm taking the ball. The ball's easier, probably. Watch. Because I can throw the ball. The ball's throwable. Can I do it? I don't know. That's pretty... Hmm. I gotta get a better throw, for sure. I'm gonna do it. There we go. Yeah. 
Yeah, screw doing it the right way. Give me that platform. <laughs> God dang. Oh, Lord. Ha 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 ha! Oh no, you stay on there. If I get Indiana Jones again, I'll be actually pretty triggered. Ah, oh, thank God, we did it. What? Got? Okay, we activated a platform and we have a teleporter. Sick. Okay. All right, now we're doing it. We're freaking doing it, boys. Oh my God, we're almost through this level. Amazing. So now I need the ball one more time. Yeah, there's probably a way to get to that cube, but I refuse to do it that way. I don't even want to figure it out. You want to figure it out? Let me know. Let me know how you did it. I've done a few unethical things in this game. Like, things that are probably not the answer, but... Like the creator said, there's multiple ways to do it. I just choose the easier way. Oh dang it. I choose the stupid man's way. Okay. Now I gotta do that thing I did last time that I don't remember how I did it, but we'll figure it out. Something, something. Yeah, there you go. That wasn't too bad. I really need to blow my nose really bad. But I just want to see what's over there first. Before I like, I don't think connecting the yellow parts is gonna be hard at all. I just want to check real quick. See if I need to reflect that laser at all. I don't think I do, but you never know. You don't know till you know. Yeah, I do. I need to reflect the laser. Big brain. Do I have to... what? Is there like a high point I can get on where I can just stand here and aim it? There we go. Nice. We did it. Yeah, I was just wanting to make sure that there wasn't something like that before I undid this. Alright, nice shot, nice shot. Infinity and beyond. Oh! <laughs> I knew I wasn't gonna make it. <laughs> I had a really gut feeling that that was not actually gonna work out to my favor, but I had to try. There pro there was a way to do it though. I could have like came from the underside after I was falling, but my reflexes obviously are not that great. Or my hook shot aim. So now we just have to do this and we're done. Okay. Yeah, too easy boys, right? Too easy. This is the easy part. Right? Right? Probably? Yeah? Not easy, I don't want it. I feel like it's gotta be something like this, probably. But I could be wrong, I have no idea. I'm not even supposed to be here today. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna give up on this for real, for real though. Like, I was just gonna like, I just spent so much time on it. I felt like I needed to help people that also wanted to beat the game maybe. And hopefully somebody else would have figured it out, but I figured it out. Me, me, the me monster. I just gotta figure out this part. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't... Okay, let's do this. Because I'm pretty sure this is gonna go over here. Oh, I know I changed it around so I could get that one part that I was really struggling with, but I'm pretty sure this goes here. Not 100% sure, but I feel it. 
And then let's move this here, because I'm pretty sure you go there. Oh no, you cannot go there, actually. Actually. Oh, you could, actually. And then something like this, and then something like this, and then we're done. Hooray. We did it. Great success. Final platform unlocked. Hopefully the actual final platform, because if there's a harder level, boy, I don't even want to look at it. <laughs> to be honest with you, if there's anything harder than what we're doing right now, I'm good. Like, uh, I'm pretty freaking hard leveled out right now. Alright, how do I get on that purple platform? You better come over here. Yeah, you come to daddy. That's a good purple platform. <sighs> Shoot. You fully masterfied the artifact. You are ready. What are you talking about? Don't worry, I'll be there. Is he evil after? Don't tell me there's more. I don't want more. I don't want more. Oh, hey, I'll watch this. Ah, not killing me. Wait, that ain't right. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. That ain't right. Wait, what? Can I use this to kill this? Wow, interesting. That's super cool. See, this is another thing they don't explain to you. You would have had to figure. I would have had to figure that out. <laughs> God damn. All right. Oh, you almost got me. Gotta be quicker than that. That's gonna be cool. Watch this though. Please let this be the last level. Don't let there be a harder level now that I've mastered the artifact or whatever, bro. I don't need a level 13. I'm happy. I'm pretty satisfied with what I've done. Yeah. The Astrian hero. Your Astrians have been alone on this planet for thousands of years. Stories about the ancient or the cataclysm have been forgotten for a long time now, and this story is no more than a legend that a few, very few people know about. However, every thousand years, one of yours comes inside the cave to save the Astria from its complete destruction. You were chosen as the 13th hero of Astria. You have to save your people. Is there 13 levels because I'm the 13th hero? This is 13th bullshit. God damn. Please. No. Oh. No. Cataclysm. God, no! No! I can't, Aji. I'm not the hero of your legend. I can't sell the Cataclysm alone. The others did. I was here to see them. And they mastered the artifact as much as you do. Find a way to weaken him. Oh, please. What is this? It's a boss? Eat lightning. That didn't work. <gasps> Bitch. Okay, so I can shoot. This isn't working. He's not taking damage. Maybe it's only the red balls that do damage. Let me just knock the red balls back. Let me see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. Blue balls might heal him, so we might not knock those back, actually. Okay. Oh. 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 Ah. 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 What are y'all doing? Okay, dude. Chill. How do I... There we go. There we go. This is amazing. Why is that not working? Am I not bouncing them good enough? Like, what do you want from me? Climbing is here. <laughs> Son of a... <laughs> My legs! <laughs> okay, well, damn it. That's not near good enough. Okay. Honestly, though, I can use the grappling hook for some of it, so I don't have to have it like a staircase, really. Oh, 
I'll hail. Nah, I blew up the thing I just made. What are you doing? Get off me, purple things. You're screwing it up! Please! Okay, let's try this now. I don't think I can. Oh, we did it! Yay! What? What? Okay, let's go up. Let's go up. Orange door? Okay, dude. <laughs> okay, dude. What are we doing here? Like, <laughs> what is my quest? Uh, I don't know if I'm supposed to be going this way yet. I think I might be doing something wrong here. on the right my shield power yeah let's do this this seems better what platform what platform do we activate is it that one okay yeah, I'm not sure about that yet we'll figure that out in a second we have other things to worry about. Alright. Now... Ha ha ha. Wait. Figure this out when we get over here. <laughs> Don't break the block, please. Thank you. Alright. We'll ride the cube here, I guess, or try to. Son of a... Oh, thank gosh. <laughs> I gotta get blood my nose. I'll be right back. Two hours. Take me. Yeah! I honestly don't know if I'm doing this right at all, but screw it. The access to the second part is blocked by a door. Its trigger is nearby. Find it. What? What? What are you talking about? Boy, I barely found this. What are you talking about? Like, for real. It's blocked by a door. What? Trigger access by door. Hell. <laughs> oh, sick. Nice. Oh, I need that cube. God, I'm gonna have to get that cube back. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Lord almighty, this game, bro. Oh, it's so insane. There's so much going on. 
And the fact that he accounted for it, like, I had to actually get to that part. Like, cause it, it doesn't really matter how I did it. The fact that I had to get to that part is insane enough. That's crazy hard to think about. In my opinion. Okay, things here, right? Bring me my cube. Bring me the cube! Oh no! Can I just shoot it? Oh <laughs> Real though. I don't think I can reach it from here. I'm about to just shoot the sucker. There it goes. the easy way or the hard way <laughs> like you're choosing the hard way I just leave it up there nice son of a my cube better be where I left it <sighs> game's insane almost broke his shield halfway and then there's more to do so that's exciting well that's one thing you can definitely say about this game it doesn't lack things to do to solve a puzzle oh, dang boy You unlocked the way! That's all I did was unlock it the way. I know where the way is though, I've seen it. I've seen it. I've seen the way. How do I get to the way? Don't know, but I've seen it. This away. Haha, <laughs> get it? The way? This away? Haha. <laughs> Losing it. <laughs> The way was over here somewhere, wasn't it? There it is. There's the way. Wow, we found the way. Can you believe it? <laughs> <coughs> oh, bullshit. That's not the way. That is apparently not the way. Can you believe it? Okay, okay. That's not the, where I want to go, actually. Please! Okay. Yeah. Why is it... Okay, there must be something on the way back that's different. Because it seems like the actual path that makes the most sense is actually the correct one, which is usually not how this works. But we'll see, I guess. Like, I think I'm just supposed to jump over there on that one, and I win. Like, I think that is it. Right? Right? Ooh! Okay, wait, 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 wait. How do I... Okay. Okay, that was just a taste. That was a taste of the... Okay, I got you, I got you. I landed on the right pad, though, so that's sick. Oh, please don't touch me! Oh, boy. Stress. Stress! I'm a freaking madman, boy! Don't let me die. <laughs> I don't want to do that over again. Oh, Lord. The way! Why is there... Do we do it? Fear holder's activated. What does that mean, boy? Do I have to backtrack and go all the way through that tail hole again? Is that what you want? There's a teleporter over there, actually. Let me take that teleporter. Now that I got the fear holders... I don't know if I activated that teleporter, though. I know I activated a teleporter, but I don't know if it was this one. Oh, thank God. Okay, what do you want, game? The sphere holders are activated. Got it. Thick. Uh, oh, it's 
purple. That's what I did, right? No, no, I did. God dang it. I put the wrong ones in the wrong. Purple, purple, blue. God darn it. I still got the blue one and the hard one, though, so hopefully that's the right blue one. How do I reset this? There, God, this dude is such a bitch. Like, that's all I feel about this dude. He is just such a bitch. Okay. Okay, okay. Please hit, please hit. Yes, An offensive weapon activated. Do the thing, kill him. Oh. Thank God, dude. Please don't make this any harder. <laughs> like, we don't need it to... This is dumb. This is dumb. Okay, dude. Oh, the red one hurts him, right? Don't use the blue ones. Okay, he's making this really freaking... Oh, you bitch. There we go. There we go. Now we're... What? What? How do I... When's his shield go away? How do I kill a sh Do I have to do all this crap over again? No. I refuse. I refuse. This is a survival part, right? Oh, wait, what about this? Hit this. Yeah, there you go. Hit this one too, bud. Please. Yeah. Why did we do that? Was there a reason? Oh, this one too, maybe. Over here. You missed. You missed, dude. You had one job. What? Not breaking. Hit it harder, please. Alright, now what? Now what? I killed the rocks. Bro, what do I do to this man? To kill him? Is there a way? Don't tell me I have to go back through there and destroy his shells again. Don't tell me that. I'm not even trying to hear it. I destroyed the rocks, right? Oh, up. Oh, Lord. Okay. Cool. More stuff. <laughs> That's what we needed. More stuff. I'm, I know I'm complaining, but I am really in awe of, like, all the work. Right color, wrong place. Right color, right place. Got you. I got you. Well, I have a blue, purple, purple, blue, blue. So that's... Because if none of these are right, right? Well, that means it's... Th <laughs> this doesn't make sense. Because it's saying... That these are in the right color and they're in the right space, right? That's what it looks like they're saying. One, two, three. One, two, three. Saying that these are in the wrong space, but the right color, but... If these are right and these are wrong... Where the fuck? Huh. So this isn't corresponding to where they're at. This is just telling me there's three right here and there's two right... Got you. Okay. Okay. So I don't know what three are right. And I don't know what to write, but I know that they're separate. So... I'm gonna assume... I think that's right. But I could be wrong. I know that nothing up here is right. Which means if nothing up here is right, that that can't be right. I need a pencil and paper. God dang it. So this one's right. These three are right. These two are right. Purple, blue. Did he put, did he put this here so we could like sit here and figure it out? That's genius if that's what it is. Let's see if this is right. I think it is. Boom! Oh my god! He is a... F Creator's a freaking mastermind, boy! He put this here so we can know where these are supposed to go. That's insane. Okay. That's an awesome puzzle. I like it a lot. That's big brain as hell, bro. 
I was really hating this puzzle, but I dig that. The fact that he put something so I didn't have to buy it and grab paper and pen to figure it out is genius. Like all the puzzles make sense. You just have to sit here and look like a dumbass for like a year and then you can figure it out. This is the best. I actually, this might be one of my favorite games. Definitely for an indie game. Get out of here, dude. Please. Okay. <sighs> this part's hard. I can't. There. Boom, baby. Boom, baby. We did it. Okay. Okay, now what do we need to do, though? Somehow I gotta raise the weapon up. I don't know how, though. Now. He's freaking turning it off like a dickhead. too fast, bro. How do I turn? I'm on to you now, bitch. I'm on to you now. You're fucked. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Okay. You're so fucked. Oh, Lord. This game's so hard. But amazing. Yeah, why don't I just do it like this? This is the right way to do it. Take that, you son of a bee. What's that? What's that up in there? Yes! Yes! Send me a red one. I'm gonna end you, boy. You are done. <laughs> oh, freaking. Oh, baby. I think we beat the game. Can you believe it? The struggle of the century. Stop dropping rocks on me while I win. Let me enjoy my moment, please. Yeah. Thank God, dude. Thank God. Tell me he's gone. Yes, Gwen, you just beat the Cataclysm. You did were the 13th Astrian hero. I am the 13th Astrian hero. But now what do I do? I get over there? Ow. Oh, the platform. Take me. What? Take me. What? Oh, hell. Was I supposed to... You grab the Cataclysm's energy, inject all of it inside the heart of Estria to refill it to full power. Beware the action will destroy your artifact. I'll destroy the artifact. If I do that, you'll be gone with him, right? It doesn't matter. Your people are dying. Hurry up. Can I not? It kind of matters. I don't even know how to use the stupid thing anyway, so why don't we just chill here? So, I guess I picked it up when I came down here somehow. I don't know how I picked it up, but I picked it up. Just letting you know. You can figure that part out, maybe. I don't know. Ow. How do I do the thing? I don't know how to do it. It didn't really tell me how to use the power up. Oh, sick. There we go. I guess it just made me shoot farther or something. Sick. We did it. Hooray. Uh, you want me to shoot this thing? Hmm. With what? Me and what power? <laughs> like... Is this what we're doing? What do you want from me, dude? I don't know. Oh. Got it. I just press E on it. Lord Almighty. Even the last thing was a puzzle. Can you believe my ring's gone? Oh well. Sorry, man. You did great things. My race continues to live. Hooray! Until the next cataclysm, and then we won't have a ring to save the world.
Sick. Whoa! No! 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 Well, I don't know. Maybe this will be easy. I don't have my ring, so. But. I can get it over there though. Watch this. This is gonna be really cool, kind of. Might be cool. Might not be cool. Oh no. Might not matter, to be honest with you. <laughs> like, even if I get it over there, that might not make any difference at all. But we'll see. Grappling hook, please. Where am I? I scream black. Game broke. Please don't make me restart. Please, God. Oh my. There's no way. I, if I die, I gotta get my screen back, right? Alright, guys. So black screen on me. So. Bro. Let me go over 14. <laughs> Alright, well. Oh, it's so nice that it does have stage select, but I was so. This stage is so long. It's ridiculously long. Oh, I'm so mad. Like, actually, that black screen on me. So that's the second run in and glitch I've run into. I still haven't solved that puzzle yet. Maybe it's a good thing, because maybe I need that I don't think so. There's no way to get that sphere back once it's in there. I don't need the sphere, I'm pretty sure. I think I had it figured out, and then the game black screened me. But at least now I won't have to edit that part, because I was stuck there forever, so... Man, that hurts me. Ugh. So, oh boy. It's tragic. That's so tragic. Where'd the cube go? Oh yeah. I forgot. How annoying this part is actually. There we go. Oh. But yeah, so it basically makes you think you're without the artifact, but apparently- Well, I'll just let the game tell you itself. Ah, dang dude. But yeah, I played through this like whole level and a black screen and i'm gonna leave the black screen in so hopefully it can help the creator when he's like working on the game or something maybe i don't know unfortunate that's all that was it's highly unfortunate yeah Lord. But yeah, this level is forever long, bro. It's just like puzzle after puzzle after puzzle after puzzle. It's just like, man, I, uh, I'm burnt out. Burnt out. This game is not made for one sitting. If you did like a level at a time, maybe not so bad. Grabbed a full power artifact of Aust Aust Austria. The ring was built after the core of Austria was refilled. The Austrian hero needs to gift to the generations to come. Anjti, how? When the cataclysm is sealed inside the heart, the energy is too powerful and the artifact can't resist. The ancient knew about it. When the heart is repowered, it creates a new one so the, your world can survive. What nice people. This floor, the last one, it will guide you, guide you to your kind. I would love to see my kind, bro. I would love it. But it's not meant to be, I don't think. Goodness gracious. Alright, give me the cube. Give me the cube, and I didn't catch it. It's actually really hard to catch. <sighs> Please! Use your freaking ring power. I know you can't grab anything with your hands for some reason, but the ring. But we got the ring floor. something else actually as well god i don't know if this is whatever as long as it works i don't care anymore <laughs> like don't care if it's the right way or the wrong way 
As long as it works, you know? And it doesn't black screen me. Okay. Where the real fun begins. The real fun. Ha ha, fun. Go ahead and do this. Took me forever to figure that out. Took me forever. Goodness gracious. I'm complaining a lot, it's just because I'm burnt. Not because the game's bad. Those two glitches are really bad though. The one with the cube despawning if you do it, if you mess up on that uh, stage 12 and, or stage 11, sorry. And that black screen, which I think was just like a random fluky error, but still highly unfortunate. Like very, very bad, unfortunate. What was I supposed to do here? Something? There it is. Take me. I'm supposed to shoot that with something. I think. Give me the cube. Oh yeah, he powers these things. Oh, God. Bro. There's not even any achievements in this game, bro. This game should have achievements. For how hard it is, there should be an achievement for like every stage. Granted, it's a one-person developer, so I'm sure that would be, like, really possibly difficult to attempt. But he did an amazing job with this game. I don't know how he thought of how to make these things work the way they do at all, but great job. No! Oh, yes! Yes! I need that cube, by the way. You're coming with me. I'm just going to run into the thing, and it'll take the cube with me. Screw it. Uh-oh. Yeah, I took the cube, but then I died like an idiot. Again. Like, glitch from one death to another. It's fried. enough. You not be a stage after the final boss. <laughs> I'm just putting that out there. I did enough. I've done enough. <sighs> I deserve to see my people. I like the concept though that you're so powerless without the ring. I like the idea of it. I just don't like the difficulty of it. Mistake, actually. Ah, that works. Whatever. It works. Break it, please. You do it? They already break it? Better be broken when I get up there. Yeah, okay, cool. Oh, fuck. Oh, never mind. I know what I did wrong there. <sighs> there we go. Been a while. Oh, I got so stuck later in the game, I can't remember the beginning puzzles of this level correctly. Port. Okay, that's where it gets interesting, boys. Ready? Ready for some fun? Some fun? Is the orange door open? Yeah. Here's some fun. This this one's crazy. What? Get ready.
so much fun. Let me tell you what. This is a really cool level though. Really difficult though, as well. Okay, so you got to aim your cannon in the top right. Make sure it's in the top right. Heaven forbid it's not in the top right. I'll try to get back in the hole without dying. Good luck. Okay. All right, we're doing it. Okay. Take me. I am yours. Okay, now what we gotta do, aim at those lasers, right? And then jump out to the laser beam and miss and miss. Please. I almost got it. I was close. I got one of them. I missed the other one. Please let me go back up there. Yeah. Thick. I missed. Again. Can you believe it? Please. I'm not even jumping far. There you go. That's what you gotta do. You know how long that took me to figure out? Fucking years, boys. Years. Now we protect the cube. Protect the cube! Now you're done. Psych! There's a billion more things we gotta do, actually. Ha 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 ha! You thought we were done? Ha ha! The reason why this stage was so hard is there's a lot of little red herring things that you can do on this stage that make you think that you need to do them, but you don't. Like this part right here. This is just extra. And I died, so that's cool. Shut up, fantasy. I got it. I lost, fantasy. Good to know. Okay. Let's, let's do that, because we don't need that anymore, actually. Fun fact. There is, should be a hook point somewhere. Right here? Yeah. Thick. Okay. You gotta take this hook point. You gotta land on that ledge. I don't know why I didn't do it the first time, but I did it. Good job, Buzz. Now, this part's actually not that bad. It didn't take me too long to figure out this part. Surprisingly. <laughs> gotta get it to stop you right in the middle. Like right here. Like so. You wanna shoot it like right when it's freaking about to start heading back. That's the best way to do it. Please don't kill me. Nice. Now, you have to breeze past it, because if you hit it more than once, it'll turn itself back off. <sighs> Be careful not to kill yourself here. I did this last time. I turned my shield off when the thing was getting here, and I died. It was amazing. <laughs> now I gotta turn it back off, like so. Actually, let's do this. No, no. We need that laser beam, I think. Let's not do what I think about. I think we might need the laser towards the end. But I'm not sure either. No, I don't. I didn't need it. But, make sure you're out of laser range, then jump. Alright, now this is where I was at before the black screen happened. This is confusing. This part is really confusing. So, what I think I was supposed to do before I glitched out and had a black screen, hopefully that doesn't happen again. Please don't happen. Because this takes a while to get to, as you can tell. And it's very frustrating and annoying. What I was trying to do, I was trying to put a block like here-ish and put a hook point here. I don't know if this is what glitched me, but I hope not because that's the only thing I can think of. And I still don't think it's the answer even after, if even if it does work, I don't know what it actually does for me yet. I'm just hoping it does something, because there's like an area up there where I need the ball, but the ball is in that hole, and I can't get it out, so hopefully this does something good, like something real good, but I don't know what it would do, okay, well, we almost landed on it, so close, please, grappling hook for me. Now I need to get underneath it enough that I'm not going to go flying everywhere. Grab it. And then take it over here. And 
and I don't know what it does. I know it does the orange platform over there, but I don't know why I need the orange platform at all yet. But maybe now I'll be able to see. Hopefully. I know I need to blow up that rock. I don't know how to do that. Honestly. So. What just killed me? What is killing me? Water. Water is killing me. Actually, a hook point in here that I can get, maybe. Do a rock. See what the orange platform gives me now that it should be moving. Okay. Like that does nothing for me. Oh, does it do some oh. Oh. Ah. Interesting. Very interesting. Still doesn't do enough though. It really doesn't. It doesn't do enough. For it to matter. I don't think anyways. Cause I don't have a way of reflecting that, bro. Is there? No, because it's going. I have to reflect it constantly. I can't just. I don't know. I can somehow reflect it, but I don't know how you would do that. Still, like it's close. Not close enough. Let me go back through the hole, see if there's anything I can maybe do. But yeah, this is where I'm stuck at. You were wondering. You're like, why is he not progressing anymore? That's because I'm stuck. <laughs> because I'm stuck. Maybe there was something I was supposed to see from the hole too. I didn't really look straight through to see if there's like another movable platform I can do or something. Let's see. Show me the hole. I thought the hole was for a ball at first, but I was like, you can't get a ball. It's impossible, actually. I just reflect my energy from here. I can't. I have an idea. It's not gonna work though. I had another cube. I can get the cube. I do that. I'm gonna do that. I am so doing that. I don't. <laughs> I don't know if it's the right thing, but it works. It definitely works. I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Ha 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 You can have three items on a platform at a time. If I can fit it, I can make it work. Oh ho oh, oh. ho! Genius, boy. This is gonna be hard, though, actually. I've done it before. I've done it before, though. I know you can do it. I don't think it's the right answer to what we're supposed to be doing, but it definitely works. If I can get, if I can fit the through platform thing, if I can't fit it, it doesn't matter, but let's see, watch this, slam jam, thank you, ma'am. <laughs> thank you for your cubage, watch this, oh, I'm freaking, in, oh, I'm sorry, please let this be the end, <laughs> like, I don't want to think anymore, uh, Honestly, if this game was- SON OF A BITCH! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh well. Tragic. Where'd the cube go? I better- That red cube though, on stage 11, you cannot remake that cube. That is not- That is not a me messing up glitch. That is a glitch glitch. I mean, not knowing the proper way to do it is me messing up, but the fact that- That should be a way to do it. It's not me messing up. Okay, now we do the magic, boys. This is where the magic happens, right here. If it works. If it doesn't work, then I guess I'm screwed. But if it works, this could be really awesome. Let me get up there real quick. I have an idea. I don't know if it's a good idea, but it's an idea.
Can I? No. Yes, baby. We did it. Can you believe it? Oh, Lord. You know how long this took me? Well, you can. I'm not taking that off. You can watch me suffer. <laughs> watch me suffer. <laughs> Lord Almighty, boy. Jeez. Louise. Can you believe it? How intricate that had to be to make that work. There might be an easier way, but I doubt it. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> okay, okay. On the bright side of this, restart. No, never mind. No! I don't want to restart anymore. Go back. Bruh. So, I had a piece I was overusing over here, maybe. I was, what I was thinking before I restarted it, right? I was thinking I could move this before I made it the conduit, but they're stuck from the beginning, so it doesn't matter. Like, at all. That was so dumb of me. Ow. Well, I have to connect these. There we go. Now I have to... Damn, dude. That's wild. Hmm. But not quite. Oh, there it is. Duh. My phone's popping off. Give me one second. Make sure it's not anything important. Nothing important, I don't think. Boom. Okay, now we gotta figure out whatever I did the first time, which was really good, but... Oh, we're almost there. I don't remember what I did, but uh, let's just start plugging away, I guess. Now I did something really cool, though. It was working like a charm until it wasn't. Oh, man. I kind of want to watch the video just to see what I did. Something like this. This looks about right. This looks about right. Alright, so now I, don't, I shouldn't have an extra piece. I think I had one down there last time, so I should have a piece that can help me solve this problem. Nope, I'm still short one. I don't understand. There's gotta be something I'm missing here. Don't know what it is, but I know this does not reach. And there's only so many freaking ways. That doesn't work. That does not work. This has got to go up here. It's got to. This has to go here. What else we do? There we go. That's it. We figured it out, boys. Can you believe it? It's a miracle. Oh my god. We're not. Nope. I thought we had it. One piece off. Okay. Well, fuck me. Like, I just don't see where I can use this piece and it not take up a space. Hmm. Let me see something. What? Wait, wait a second. Is this it? No. Be nice if it was though. Wait a second, maybe. Give me a second. Let's see. Is this it? 
Oh my god, we did it, boys. Can you believe it? Oh my god. What's happening? What's happening? Rumbling. Oh my god, there's a thing. Oh, we beat the game, I think. Oh my freaking lord. Magic. That's magic. What a magical moment. Game's frozen. <laughs> Notre voyage ici. Our journey ends here. Voilà, when the artifact energy fades, I will need you to give it to the next generation. Congratulations, Gwen. Your bravery deserves to join the legend of Astria. Austria. <sighs> this game was amazing. But so, probably the hardest game I've ever beaten. Puzzle wise, for sure. I don't, not, maybe not the hardest, because I've played a lot of hard platformers. But the hardest puzzle game I've ever beaten. Remy Adriano is a freaking genius. <laughs> I don't know how you come up with these puzzles, bro. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully this video helps you. Uh, if you like puzzles, I definitely recommend this game. But, if you like puzzles, I'll try to beat it on your own. And then watch this video if you get stuck. But, lord almighty. Definitely worth the play. Rewarding. I got my boat. Now I get to sit here and age and die. Pretty amazing. For more information... I'm gonna look up more information about him. See if he's a genius. Let me look. Guy's own website. HTTPS RemyAdriano.com Adriano.com Did I type it right? Hopefully. If there's an accent symbol, I guess I'm screwed because I don't know how to type them. Ah. Technical game designer. Who am I? Getting back to my first passion. I was a primary school teacher in French Alps, and I I knew it was French. I'm a genius. Can you believe it? No, no. He's a genius, but I recently quit to become a game developer. I worked for a year on my very first game pro video game project using Unreal Engine 4. I started using Unreal Engine 4 as a challenge when I was a teacher after a few weeks. Figuring out how the engine worked, I was completely hooked to it. The feeling of learning new sets of abilities was while using my programming skills again after my after many years was exhilarating. This is when the idea of developing the full game came to my mind. I started to imagine what the game could look like, what the player's abilities could be. The process of creating something from a blank page was really nice. This is when I realized I wanted to start a career as a game developer. I quit, in, quit my job as a teacher and lived on my savings for a year. In order to be be able to work full time on this new project of life, a year later, Astria is live on Steam, and I have a brand new skillet. Skill set. God dang, I can't read. Oh, this true skillet. I had to learn how to use Unreal Engine 4, but I quickly realized it won't be enough. I also needed to look into the basics of Blender, GIMP, and Audacity to add more content inside Astria. I created this entire project. Man, can I support the creator? My hobbies, I would say these ones, port, dev, drink, development, drink, play, my uh, games. Can I donate? Do you have like a donate button? Like, you should put a donate button so we can like <laughs> support you for your work, bro. Oh, uh, this was the hardest game of my life, but it was amazing. And I like his website. It's really nice. Dude's a genius. Big brain. I can't believe he's like a school teacher and you picked, he did this in a year, dog. It takes some game companies like tens year, 10 years to come up with something that's not even as good. Oh, God. I'm going to send him an email. Hopefully, I'm going to ask him if there's a way to donate because this is amazing. If there is, if he tells me there's a way to donate, I'll let you guys know in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it helps. Uh, bye.